Hello, good evening, Azucena. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Gracias a Dios. Bien y en casa. Very good, excellent. Eso sí es muy bueno, mire. Eso sí me alegra escucharlo. Right, very good. Good to have you in class, Azucena. We're gonna get started, right? Let me see, let me look for the PPT. I'm gonna share it with you. Right, as always on time, Azucena, excellent. And also we have Francisco by now. So let me see. We have, what do you do? Right, today we're going to practice with another different tense. And also we are going to have some conversations, right? Which are going to help us improve our, our speaking. So let's see, we are in class number six. Let me say hi to the other ones. Hello, Francisco, how are you? Good evening, teacher. I cannot complain, thank you. I'm pretty good, thank you so much for asking. Let me see, Adrianita. Hi, Adriana. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo le va? Hi, Ellen. Excellent. Very good. Very good. I'm happy to see you. All right, everybody. Let's get started. All right. Before you fall asleep, antes de que nos dormamos. <laughs> let's see. Do you remember? All right, as per usual, you know that I have these questions to remember content learned. So let's see. We have mentioned at least three vocabulary words related to furniture. Let's see, Adriana. Tell me three vocabulary words related to furniture. Tres palabras del vocabulario que ustedes aprendieron relacionado a, lo, a la mueblería, right? O a los muebles. Como por ejemplo, microwave, oven. Eh, refrigerator. Refrigerator. Creo en la que estaba. Uh -huh. Refrigerator. Um. Ay, ya no me acuerdo los demás. <risa> ¿Y copié el podcast, <risa> No, no lo copié. Ay, Adriana, my heart, my heart is broken. Se me rompió el corazón, se me quebró. Let's see. Let's see, a ver si alguno de sus compañeros le puede ayudar. We have Azucena, Francisco, or Estreberto. ¿Algún voluntario para decirme la number, three, number one? Um, hi, teacher. Um, uh, vocabulary, vocabulary, furniture, um, stool, lamp, bell, uh, desk, Table, chair, I'm chair, um, etc. etc. Very good. I like that. <laughs> Excellent, right? Remember, please remember to copy the vocabulary, to copy the information that you believe you're going to need, right? Because you are learning and part of the learning process is for you to copy and take notes, right? So let's see, let's get started with the other one. Number two, mention at least three jobs that you learned last class. Tres trabajos o profesiones que aprendimos la clase pasada. Let me see, Ronnie. Uh, the last, the last class. Uh -huh. Hola. Hello, dígame. Hello. Sí, me oye, sí. Sí. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Uh, doctor, and cashier, um, lawyer, la lawyer, 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 lawyer. Uh -huh, exactly. Very good, very good. <laughs> Ronnie, excellent. Let's see. <clears throat> Somebody else, what about you, Lourdes? Tell me three jobs, please, that you remember. Tres trabajos que usted recuerda, Lourdes. Mm 
Okay, let me have then Fabiola. Tell me three jobs, Fabiola. Okay, we don't have Fabiola either. Let me Hello, see. teacher. Hello, Mr. Roberto. Save me, please. Okay. Tell me three jobs. Es, eh, me acuerdo de dos. Eh, musician, Curate Guard, Guard, no me acuerdo cómo era. Y Pasher. Security Guard. Security Guard y Musician. Excelente, thank you. Uh -huh. Doctor. Doctor, all right, excelente. Me regalan un segundo porque creo que puedo tener mala conexión a internet, entonces voy a conectar el cable, all right? I'll be right back. Give me just one second. Now I'm back. Thank you so much. So let's continue. Thank you, Estraberto. That was right. You are correct, okay? Security guard, we had plenty of them. Let me check. Okay, for the ones that didn't copy the vocabulary last class, I have it in here. So please take your screenshots or whatever you do to study, copy or take notes, right? Let's see. Let me have... Laura Pamela. Hey, Laura, tell me three jobs from here, please. Only three. Eh, que le mencione tres. Exactly. Uh, job, eh, musician, and eh, waiter. Right, very good. Thank you. Let me have Azucena. Tell me three jobs, please. Okay, Miss uh, George, singer, waitress, a pilot. Pilot, excellent, very really good, very really good. All right, everybody. I will tell you once again the vocabulary. Let's listen and pay attention. Here we go, right? Thank you so much uh, for the people who participate in this part already, okay? Here we go. Cashier, cook or chef, Doctor, flight attendant, touch, lawyer, musician, nurse, pilot, police officer, receptionist, salesperson. <laughs> You're right. Um, security guard, singer. Waiter and waitress. Okay, let me check. Let me just answer one, one message that your classmate sent. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let's continue. All right, everybody. This is the vocabulary. Okay, Adriana, tell me three jobs from here, please. Sales, sales person, sales person, sales person, security guard, waiter, waitress. Okay, repeat after me, Adriana. Security person. No, I mean security guard. Security guard. Right, security guard. Se security guard. All right, let's try to pay attention. Here we go. And let's go with the last one, waiter. Waiter. Mm -hmm. That's true. Thank you, Adriana. Very good. All right, let's move on, guys. Now, as I, as I showed you yesterday, we have the different pictures, right, related to the vocabulary that we have. But it's kind of complicated to try to find the correct ones. So let me go with this one. 
places. Let me ask um, Ronnie, can you please tell me the places? Places in a hospital, in an office, in a store, in a hotel. Excellent, thank you. Let's go with Estreberto. Estreberto, tell me please the activities. Uh, we wear a uniform, say up tight, take two people, work hard, stand up tight. Uh, esta, ¿Cómo se pronuncia la siguiente? Handles. ¿Es? ¿Cómo? Handles. Hello. Handles. Hello. Handles. Handles. Words and night. Words and night. Right. Ticket. All right. Excellent. Thank you, sir. Very good. A Susana, tell me the activities, please. Okay, Miss. Um... Wears a uniform, sits all day, talks to people, works hard, stands all day, handles money, works at night, writing tickets or tickets. That's, no, tickets. Tickets, okay. Yes. Excellent, thank you girl, very good. Now listen guys, the reason why I'm doing this again, repeating this vocabulary, is because you're going to Friday, Saturday, and Sunday in which you probably won't practice, right? Because those are your free days. Well, actually you gotta work maybe Friday and Saturday, but other than that, Sunday is going to be your free day. So probably you won't practice. That's the reason why we are doing it right now. So take advantage of it. If you got a mistake, I can help you to improve that, right? So let's go with Fabiola Cruz. Fabiola, tell me the places, please. Um, in a hospital, in an office, in a store, in an auto. Excellent, thank you. Lourdes, are you there, Lourdes? Yes, teacher. Okay, tell me the activities. Okay, wears a uniform, sits all day, talks to people, works hard, stands all day, handles money, Worse and at night, right ticket. Excellent, thank you. Let me go with Francisco Hernandez. Tell me the places, please. In a hospital, in an office, in a store, in a hotel. Excellent, thank you. And Sandrita, Sandra Yanira, tell me the activities, please. Okay, uh, activities. Where's a uniform? Sits all day, talks to people, works hard, stands all day, hands money, works at night, writes ticket. Excellent, thank you. All right, everybody. And let me see, the last one is going to be Laura Pamela. Okay, Laurita, tell me the places, please. And in a hospital, in an office, in a store, in a office. All right, in a hotel. All right, everybody. Let's try to give the emphasis to the words that deserve the emphasis, right? For example, in a hospital. If you tell me in a hospital, mm -mm, that's not correct. In a hospital, in an office, in a store, in a hotel. Let's try to give that emphasis, all right? It's going to help you improve your English learning, okay? So let's continue. Pronunciation, reduction, do and does. Listen, as you may have noticed, sometimes when a native speaker or a usual speaker is talking, sometimes you hear that some words are like, a, like an, in a conjunction, right? They are together. That's what you hear, although they are separated they sound like if they were together. So that's why it's important to realize and to learn how to recognize the appropriate reduction of do and does so that we don't get any mistakes or we don't get confused. Here we go. Where do you work? Where do you work? 
if you notice, I'm not saying where do you work? No, where do you work? Where do you work? What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? All right. Where does he work? Where does he work? Where does he work? What does he do? What does he do? What does he do? Where do they work? Where do they work? Where do they work? What do they do? What do they do? What do they do? All right, listen, it might sound difficult, it might sound funny, puede sonar inclusive difícil o gracioso, right? Escuchar eso, pero that's reality. Así lo hablan los native speakers, así lo hablamos nosotros que estamos aprendiendo en este salón ahorita, right? Este salón virtual, así tenemos que hablar, right? Porque son reductions. Si ustedes las ponen en práctica, cuando las escuchen, no les va a costar ni le van a tener miedo. Right? Por ejemplo, hay un tiempo gramatical que se llama el futuro con going to. Ahí hay una reduction. En vez de decir going to, decimos gonna. Right? La reduction no se escribe, no la escribimos. Pero cuando la pronunciamos, sí hacemos énfasis. Y es necesario que aprendamos a escuchar esas reductions porque las personas que hablan el idioma las hacen constantemente, 24-7. Right? So let's try to keep this in mind. Let me go with, we're going to start. ¿Desean que las vuelva a repetir o ya, ya estuvo y ahora van a pasar ustedes a practicar? Si las puede repetir. Yes, por, miss. Repita, por favor. Okay. Que eso Good. parece trabalenguas. <laughs> yes, a uh, tongue twister. Un trabalenguas, a tongue twister. It's true. But here we go. Where do you work? Where do you work? What do you do? What do you do? Where does he work? Where does he work? What does he do? What does he do? Where do they work? Where do they work? What do they do? What do they do? Right? Let's check. Let's check. Ustedes van a encontrar el video. Al video le van a poder dar replay <laughs> thousands of times, all right? Las veces que quieran. It's okay. But here we go. Meanwhile, con esta practiquita que yo les acabo de hacer, ahora les va a tocar a ustedes. Solo déjenme ver esto por aquí. Aquí está. Esto va a ser más fácil el, el procedimiento para ustedes. Right? Practice time. Aquí, si ustedes lo notan, está separado. Right? Y si ven, inclusive la máquina lo tira que eso está malo porque no se puede escribir así. Pero sí se puede pronunciar así. So, where do you work? Where do you do? No. Where do you work? Where does she no? Where does she work? Where do they work? What do you do? What does he do? What do they do? Right? Ya están unidos. Vamos a tratar de hacerlo. Aunque no vayamos tan rápido, vamos a tratar de hacerlo. Okay? Let's practice. ¿Quién quiere ser el, el primer volunteer? <laughs> Let's see. Yo inicio. Excellent, Ronnie. Very good. Action. Uh, where do you work? Where do you where do you work? Where does where do where does he work? Where do they work? What do you do? What what do he do? What do they do? It's travel eso. No, but it's okay. You did great. Excellent. Thank you. Bravo. Excellent. Another volunteer. Les estoy dando la oportunidad que ustedes se digan, Miss Joe. Okay. Me. A me. Okay, let me see. ¿Quién dijo a mí? Hi, Ronnie. Okay. Ron, Ronnie. Ronnie, ¿no era usted el que había pasado? No. Ah, chale. Y yo, no. teacher, es Reverto. Es Reverto. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Pero fíjese, es Reverto, que no me aparece encendido su micrófono. Y el de Ronnie sí me aparece siempre encendido. <laughs> All right. So, I'm sorry. Yeah. Bueno, entonces voy a volver a aplaudirle, es Reverto, because you did great. Lo hizo pretty good. All right. Action. Ahora sí, Ronnie, your turn. Uh, where do you work? Where do you work? Where does he work? What do they work? What do you do? What does he do? What do they do? Now you see, easy peasy, bien facilito, right? Yeah. Excellent. 
Sí. All right, let's go with somebody else. Another volunteer. What about the girls? What happened, girls? Me, teacher. Okay, let's see. Excellent. Hello? Look for this. Yes. Okay. okay. Um, where do you work? Perdón. Where do you work? Where do you work? Where does he work? Where do where do they do? Uh, sorry. Where do they work? What do you do? What does he do? What do they do? All right, excellent. Bravo, Lourdes. That's correct. Thank you. Now, listen, les cuento algo funny, algo gracioso. Una vez cuando estaba estudiando, right? Eh, estaba en primer año, escuché a una native, pero ella era de California, I think so. Entonces, ellos sí que lo hablan súper rápido, súper, súper rápido, right? Entonces, ella me dijo, where you gonna get? Así, literal, así lo dijo, where you gonna get? Y yo estaba en first year. So I was like, man, I don't get you. No te entiendo. Puedes repetirlo de nuevo, but this time in a slower pace, please. Entonces, por eso les digo, tenemos que ensayar mucho ese oído. Hasta ahorita los que han participado vamos bien, excelent. Me gusta. All right. Pero todos, todos tienen que llevar ese mismo nivel porque todos estamos participando por igual aquí. All right. So let's go. Any other volunteer? Otro voluntario? Empiezo. I miss. Excellent, Azucena. That's my girl. Action. Uh, where do you work? Where do you work? Uh, where does he work? Where do they work? What do you do? What does he do? What do they do? That's correct. Excellent. Beautiful. Let's go with somebody else. A man or a woman. Let's see, okay, I'm gonna start asking then. Let's go with Francisco. Let's see, Francisco. Try your lucky. Where do you work? Where do you work? Where does he work? Where do you they work? Ah, sorry. Where do they work? What do you do? What does he do? What do they do? That's correct, excellent, sir. Very good. Let's go with Fabiola. Let's see, Fabiola. Hi. The pronunciation is complicated. <laughs> yes. Action. Where do you work? Where do you work? Where do he work? Where do they work? What do you do? What do he do? What do they do? All right, excellent. Thank you, Fabiola. Very good. Let me go with somebody else. What about Miguel Morales? Where do you work? Where do you work? Where does she work? Where do they work? What do you do? What does she do? What do they do? That's correct. Excellent, sir. Thank you. Let's go with Sandrita. Where do you work? Where do you work? Where does he work? Where do they work? What do you do? What does what does he do? What do they do? All right, excellent. Thank you. Very good. Laura Pamela, your turn, Laurita. Mm, okay. Where do you work? Where do you work? Where does he work? Where do they work? What do you do? What does he do? What do you do? What do they do? All right, excellent. Thank you, Laurita. Bravo. Excellent. And let me see, Adriana Guerra, your turn. Where do you go? Where do you go? Where does he go? Where do they go? What do you go? What do you do? What does she do? What do they do? All right, excellent, Adriana. Very good. Now you see. Easy, easy. Facilito. Let me see. Solo Adrianita aquí is where does she do, right? No, what does she do, right? What does she do? Thank you, let me go with, where does he do? No, what does he do? Este es para el he, right? What does he do? And let me go with Manuel. Let's see, Manuel, if you can't do it. Yes, good evening, teacher. 
Good evening. Mm, where do you work? Where do you work? Where does he work? Where do they work? Mm, what do you do? What does he do? What do they do? All right, that's great. Excellent. Thank you, sir. Now, everybody, what do you think about this? ¿Qué piensan de esto? So far, ¿qué piensan de esto? A ver. Easy, simple, difficult. So, so. So, in the middle, uh huh. Right, very good. Thank you, Susana. All right, everybody, let's try to keep the pace. All right, here we go. Simple present, double H questions. And let me see. Well, only double H questions. Okay, here we go. Conversation. He works in a hotel. All right, this is a funny conversation. So let's pay attention. Here we go. Let me see. I'm going to read it first. Just the only thing that you have to do is just pay attention. Okay, here we go. Where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's a front desk agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager, right? So a funny controversial, you know, because there are girls talking, all right? They're talking about their brothers and actually one of them is the manager and the other one is above the manager. So let's see. Let's go with somebody to practice. Let me have Estreberto, you are Rachel, and Fabiola Cruz, you are Angela. Action. Where did your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works by a hotel too? He is an unfriended agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He does like the manager. Uh, that's about what hotel does he work for? The plaza. That's funny. <laughs> My brother work there too. Oh, that's interesting. Thing. What do you, what do is he do? Actuality, he is the manager. <laughs> All right, excellent. Thank you, Estreberto and Fabiola. Now, let's check the vocabulary. Estreberto, repeat after me. Interesting. ¿Cómo, cómo, cómo? Interesting. Interesting. Uh, interesting. Ajá, uh -huh, that's great. Very good. Ahí lo dijo perfecto. Interesting. Ahora con esta, Estreberto, what does he do? What does he do? Mm -hmm. That's correct, sir. Thank you. Uh, let's see, Fabiola. Repeat after me. Actually. 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 Very good. Thank Actually. you, Fabiola. Una pregunta, yo me acuerdo de que había como una tipo, bueno, es que no sé si es regla, con, con esta del, ¿sí? O sea, no me acuerdo si era cuando termina en vocal, con una pronunciación y cuando va en consonante, con otra pronunciación, pero no me acuerdo bien cuál era. Really, I haven't heard about that one yet, <laughs> all right? But in this case, you don't have el T at the end. Como en este caso no podemos decir actuality, uno porque no existe, right? Y otro porque no aparece la T at the end. So you just have to say actually, que es lo que significa. Actually, no significa actualmente, right? Les digo eso por si acaso se nos había cruzado, no significa actualmente, right? Actualmente es nowadays o for the record or something else, pero no actually. Actually, es como decir en realidad. All right. So let's see. En este caso, Fabiola, 
and you just have to take advantage of the fact that it doesn't have a T at the end. So you just have to say actual, right? Let me go with Miguel Morales. You are Rachel and Lourdes. You are Angela. Action. Where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother work in a hotel too. He's a front desk. Again? How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the management. That's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The plus, the plaza. That's funny. My brothers work there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. All right, excellent, guys. Thank you so much. That was pretty good. Let's check vocabulary. Let's see, Miguel. Repeat after me. He's a front desk agent. He's a front desk agent. Mm -hmm. That's correct, sir. Thank you. Okay. Let me go with Sandra Yanira. Sandra, you are Rachel. And Manuel, you are Angela. Action. Okay. Where did your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother worked in a hotel. In, oh, oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's from the staging. How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What, whole, what hotel does he work for? The Plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, oh that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he is the manager. That's great. Excellent. Thank you, guys. Very good. Let me go with Ronnie Avalos. Ronnie, you are Rachel and Laura Pamela, you are Angela. Action. What does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in the hotel too. He's a front desk agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like to manage it. For four. Ahorita, can you repeat again? Porque solo escuchamos el four. El dos, he worked for. Uh -huh, Ronnie. Plaza, the plaza. That's funny, my brother worked there too. <laughs> yeah, maybe her audio is not working very well. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the money. Very good, <laughs> role play. <laughs> Excellent, thank you, sir, very good. Thank you. thank you for finishing the conversation. Let's go with Azucena, you are Rachel, and Francisco, you are Angela. Uh, teacher. Uh -huh. This is hotel or hotel? Hotel. Hotel, hotel, hotel. Okay, thank you. Very good, Excellent. Sí, hay que tratar de darle sonido ya a las palabras, ¿ok? Yo sé que están en el Beginners 2, pero ya pueden empezar a darle sonido a las palabras, ¿ok? Porque si no, si nos acostumbramos a decirla tal y como está escrita, después nos va a costar agarrarle en realidad cómo va la modalidad de la palabra en la pronunciación, right? Let's go with Azucena. You are Rachel. 
Francisco, you are Angela. Action. Okay, Miss. Uh, where where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's a front desk agent. How does he like? Not, not very much. He doesn't like the manager. Back to what? What hotel does he work for? The plaza? That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. That's correct, excellent. Thank you guys. Now, with this, we have practiced our speaking. Let me see, I'm missing Adrianita. Okay, Adriana, so I'm going with you. Yo voy con usted. Let me see, Adriana, ¿quieres ser Rachel or Angela? Angela. Okay, here we go. Where does your brother work? Young other, hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's a front desk agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That do bad. What hotel? What hotel does he work for? The plaza. The plaza. That's funny. My brother got thrift too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. Excellent. Thank you, Adrianita. Very good. All right, guys. Thank so there you. you have it. This is the practice for today's class. We should indeed move on. Okay, here we go. What do we have? Simple present. So far, you already saw simple present do questions, uh, yes or no questions, all right? Right now, we are going to have in a deep way the simple present WH questions. Let's pay attention. Where do you work? In a hospital. What do you do? I'm a doctor. Recuerden, este, esta es una contraction. No puedo decir I am, porque I am es cuando está alargado, right? Cuando está en su forma natural. Pero aquí ya tenemos una contraction. Entonces yo no voy a decir I am. Voy a decir I'm a doctor. How do you like, how do you like it? I really like it. Cuando les preguntan, how do you like it? Es cuánto les gusta, right? I really like it. I really don't like it. Or oh, I like it. I don't like it that much. It's going to depend on your answer. Where does he work? Where does he work? In a hotel. In a hotel. What does he do? What does he do? He's a manager. He's a manager. How does he like it? How does he like it? It's okay. Where do, you, where do they work? Where do they work? In a restaurant. In a restaurant. What do they do? What do they do? They are writers. I oh, know, waiters. <laughs> waiters. How do they like it? They hate it. All right? They hate it. Okie dokie, let's get started with your preparation, with your training in this field. Let's see, let's go, let's start with Manuel. Let's see, Manuel, you ask, usted pregunta, only these three questions, okay? No, todas las va a ser mejor, una práctica larga. Okay. And all the questions, and let me look for you, escoja una víctima, Manuel, que quiera que participe con usted en la respuesta. Victimario. <laughs> let's see, let's choose. Quiero ver quiénes están. Carla Fabiola. Ok. Action. Fabiola, usted contesta. Ok. 
Okay, where do you work? In a hospital. What do you do? I'm a doctor. And how do you like it? I really like it. Where does he work? In a hospital? No, in a hotel. In a hotel. What does he do? He's a manager. How does he like it? It's okay. Where do they work? In a restaurant. What do they do? They are, no, they are waiters. How do they like it? They had it. Hate it. They hate it. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo es la, la de en medio? Hate. Esta hate. Hate y después it. They hate it. Exactly. Significa que lo odian, ¿no? Right? Oh, ah, sí, pero es que la, la pronunciación junta de the hate y it, como hate. que, pues, ah, no sé, la colapso mental. <risa> no, do not worry. It's just practice thing, all right? La mayoría de cosas es práctica, right? ¿Qué digo la mayoría? Todo es práctica. All right, thank you, Manuel and Fabiola. Very good job. Very good fluency. Very good mood. Excellent. No mistakes. Let's see. Let me go with Azucena. Azucena, choose your victim, please. Azucena, you ask and choose somebody to answer. Okay, Miss. Ahorita estoy vigiando a mi víctima. <laughs> <laughs> Sí, porque así lo dicen, mis fedes solo a mí me ponen, ¿no? All right. So, you Quiero choose. que mi víctima sea Pamela. Ok, action, Pamela, usted contesta. Ok, where do you work? In a hospital. What do you do? I'm a doctor. How do you like it? I really like it. Where does he work? In a hotel. What does he do? He's a manager. How does he like it? It's okay. Where do you they work? In a restaurant. What do you they do? They're waiters. How do they like it? They hate, they hate. Um, how do you pronounce it? They hate it. They had it. Mm -hmm. Exactly, that's correct. Very good, girls. Excellent. Good job. Let me go with. Let's see, Ronnie. Choose your victim to answer your questions. Carla. Carla. Fabiola, Fabiola. Ah, she already passed. Ella pasó. Ah, ah. Let's see. Ya Carla, Azucena y Pamela, Laura Pamela ya pasaron y también Manuel. Yanira. Yanira, Sandra Yanira. Ok. Action, Sandrita, you answer. Usted contesta, Sandrita. Ok. Hi, Marachita. Ay, Marachita, ya sabía. <risa> <risa> Really? Te conocen, okay? Yes. Okay. Where do you work? In a hospital. What do you do? I'm a doctor. How do you like it? I do you like it. Where does he work? In a hotel. What does he do? He's a manager. How do he like it? It's okay. Where do they work? In a restaurant. What do they do? They wait it. How do they like it? They hate it. Okay. Good job, Marachita. <laughs> All right, excellent, guys. Thank you so much. Very good. Now you see, ahora en adelante lo voy a poner a escoger a usted. Ustedes saben que victims are the ones that you need and you want. <laughs> Let me go with Francisco. Let's see, Francisco, Francisco, choose somebody, please. Usted escoge y usted pregunta. Uh, Adriana. Adriana Guerra, okay? So Adriana, you answer. Usted responde, Adriana. 
Okay. Where do you work? Ian Hospital. What do you do? I am a dog. I am a doctor. How do you like it? I really like it. Where does he work? Ian Oil. What does he do? He's a manager. How does he like it? It's okay. Where do where do they work? He has rest he has restaurant. What do they do? They write. How do how do they like it? They ha they hate it. They hate it. Hate it. Excellent. Thank you guys. Very good job. Thank you, Adrianita and Francisco. And let me go with Estreberto. Estreberto, I think that we are only missing Lourdes and Miguel. Creo que son las únicas victims that we have. So, choose. Ustedes cogen. ¿Quiénes están? De... Solo Miguel Morales and Lourdes. Ah, Miguel. Sí. Action. Usted pregunta, Estreberto, y Miguel contesta. Okay. Where do you work? In a hospital. What do you do? I a doctor. How do you like? I really like. Where do he work? In a hotel. What does he do? He's a manager. How the how does he like it? It's okay. Where do they work? In a restaurant. What do, do, what do they do? They quite waiters. How do they, how do they like it? <laughs> Trava lengua. Tongue twister. They hate it. Excellent. Both of you. Thank you, sir. Now, Laurita, let's see, Laurita. Here we go. You ask me, I answer. Okay. Usted me pregunta, Laurita. Digo, lo urdes. Okay. I mean, lo urdes. Lo siento es que las dos oh, tienen L. Oh. <laughs> okay, action, lo urdes. Usted me pregunta. Eh, ah, okay. Where do you work? In a hospital. What do you do? I'm a doctor. How do you like it? I really like it. Where does he work? In a hotel. What does he do? He's a manager. How does he like it? It's okay. Where do they work? In a restaurant. What do they do? They are waiters. How do they like it? They hate it. All right, excellent Lourdes, thank you so much. All right, everybody, so there you have it, very good practice. Now, let's get started with this. Double H questions structure, all right? Ya practicamos, pues sí, mismo, pero ¿cuál es la estructura? There you have it. Double H word plus do or does, recuerden, esta no se pronuncia do es, right? This one is does, does. Then you got the subject and then the complement, right? Pero para hacer la question, ¿qué me falta aquí en la estructura? A ver. Tic -tac, tic -tac. Question mark. Question mark. That's great. Excellent. Very good. Question mark. Okay. I cannot have, <clears throat> I cannot have questions without the question mark. All right. So let's get started. Let me see. Fabiola, can you please read these questions? Me lee estas preguntas. Um, okay. Um, where does Mari work? Y where does he do? Mm -hmm. Right, aquí era, what does he do? <laughs> ah, sí, right. perdón. Al momento de crear los examples, todo se me viene a la mente. <laughs> Toda la palabra que quiero venir. Sí, ¿verdad? Dos. ¿Ah? Así se pronuncia, dos. 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 
Y el otro era el doesn't, ¿verdad? Doesn't, exactly, in negative. All right, everybody, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Just one, one simple question. Van a hacer una pregunta simple. Pueden decir, um, where do I buy food? ¿Dónde compro la comida? ¿Dónde puedo comprar la comida, right? Where do I buy food? Uh, where do I go out? Where does she go out? Uh, cualquier cosa pueden preguntar haciendo uso de esta estructura, ¿ok? Let's practice, please. Teacher, how many sentences? Only one. If you want to do more, you can do more. But if not, just one. Minimum, okay. una. <laughs> All right, obviously. <laughs> In el máximo, okay. las que ustedes quieran. Son bienvenidos. Apro aprovechen de practicar, all right? Porque el fin de semana no es tan largo, pero <laughs> solo pueden aprovechar ahorita para practicar. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Una preguntita. Vaya, por ejemplo, así como yo le estructuré, o sea, es como pregunta, sí, por eso se lo puse. Al ponerla con, con do, ¿cuál sería la diferencia al momento de, como de, cómo le explico, de entenderla con do y con dos? Es que el do es para singular, Fabioleta, right? Para el do, usted nunca me puede preguntar si le va a preguntar a una sola persona o se va a preguntar a sí misma. Uh -huh. No puede decir, what does I do? <laughs> All right? No puede. Uh -huh. El auxiliar que usted va a utilizar para first person singular va a ser do. Pero ya para third person singular, solo para tercera persona, Fabiolita, solo tenemos el she, el he y el it. Entonces, solo uh -huh. para ellos tres vamos a utilizar el does. Ok. Ahorita se la pongo. Excellent. Thank you. Very good, Azucena, excellent. Solo que es at work. La T nada más. De ahí todo está perfecto. What about the other ones? Have you finished? Terminaron? Recuerden que en las double H words tenemos bastantes, right? Tenemos el which, tenemos el what, el where. Very good. This one yes. is really good. Uh -huh. No sé si dijeron miss o finish. Finish. Ah, okay. Excellent. Let's see. Let's go with Miguel. Tell me your sentences. When do, you, when do they eat lunch? Where does she live? Very good. Very good. That's correct. 
somebody else? Alguien más que ya finalizó? Teacher, uh -huh. I can say, where do you buy the food? Disculpe, pasó una moto afuera de mi casa y se escuchó. Let's see, ¿puede repetir de nuevo? Uh -huh. Where do you buy the food? Uh -huh. Where do you buy the food? That's, that's okay? Yeah, that's it's fine. okay. Okay. It's okay. Only one, Ronnie. Ya. Yeah. Ah, se tomó a pecho la, la, lo que dije, right? Only one. Yeah. Okay, thank you, sir. Very good. Alguien más? What about Laura? Estreberto? Eh, yo. Okay, Laurita, tell me. What does she in the afternoon? What does she do in the afternoon? Very good. What about you, Manuel? Yeah, I'm finished. Okay. Tell me your question, please. Uh, what does he do for a living? All right, very good question. Thank you, sir. Let me go with somebody else. What about Sandrita or Estreberto? Okay, este, vamos a ver, no sé si estará buena. Eh, <laughs> Where did you buy your clothes? Where did you buy your clothes? Where do you buy your clothes? Your clothes, yeah. Okay, very good. Thank you, Estreberto, si está correcta. Y en el caso de Adriana, la primera que hizo está perfecta. Where do you live? Pero ya la segunda, no, amiga, porque me está utilizando el progresivo y ahorita estamos con simple present y tampoco tiene el auxiliar do. Y lo necesitamos ya que estamos trabajando con do or does. All right. Ya solo me falta Sandrita. Ok. Where do I buy a dress? Where do you call it? Very good. Where do I buy a dress? Excellent. Very good. All right, guys. Let me see. So far, do you think this topic is... Clear by now? Ah, Lourdes. Lourdes, usted me falta. Let's see. Yes, teacher. Uh, where do you see the movie? Mm -hmm. Very good. Where do you see the movies? All right. Excellent. Thank you. Now, is the topic clear so far? ¿Está el tema clarito como el agua hasta ahorita? Sí. Yeah. Okay, excellent. Yes, All right, everybody. Very good. All right, now listen. For next class, we are going to check this conversation, right? Placement of adjectives. Conversation, that's exciting. Exciting. Okay, now listen. Maybe some of you practice already. You're speaking when you are not in the class, but we have other students that they do not practice outside of the classroom. So they do have to practice. So I will see you on Monday. Please connect your class as you have done today and we will practice, all right? All right, everybody, have a okay. great night. If you need help during the weekend, let me know, all right? Bye. Okay, have a nice weekend, Tisha. Thank Bye. you. Have a nice weekend, everybody. And God bless you. Thank you. Good night. Bye, bye, bye everybody. Bye, good night. See you bye. Monday. Cha cha. Bye bye. Bye. Cha cha. <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs>